Flying is an easy, relaxing way to travel, especially when going long distances. But have you ever considered who's in the cockpit? Most times it's likely a male flying the plane, but one triad woman is changing that narrative. Meet a trailblazing female pilot. You ready? Let's go. <laughs> May Kay Beeler wants a household name in the triad. About 37 years ago, I had the opportunity to learn to fly for a TV assignment. Beeler hosted a television show in the 80s called PM Magazine on WFMY News 2 and was offered a once in a lifetime opportunity she couldn't pass. And I was just blessed beyond measure when the assignment came up. We want you, May Kay, to learn to fly. She says Sally Ride, the first American woman in space, is her unofficial mentor. Beeler says when Sally Ride was flying into outer space, she was learning to fly a plane. I was practicing for world aviation records when I was pregnant with my son. And Beeler says aviation is in her son's DNA. So he flew when I was pregnant with him for like up to eight months and I became a flight instructor at the time and the FAA pilot examiner, when I passed that uh, flight instructor certificate, they gave him a certificate too. More than 30 years later, her son is now an air show pilot and aerospace engineer. Yeah, RJ's brilliant and better pilot than I'll ever be or his father will ever be and we're grateful for that. That's evolution. With men traditionally found in the cockpit, Beeler's mission is to bring more women into the field. In 2013, Beeler founded the Diva Flight Experience to inspire women to fly. We put you in the cockpit of a real airplane at the flight controls flying an airplane. It's not a simulator. You're in the pilot seat. Beeler let me test the experience. So this should all come alive here in a minute. Ooh. Just pull it back and the elevator goes up. And what happens is as it goes up, it displaces the air above it. Beeler says this flight program is her way of flying it forward. If a girl can see it, she can be it. And all it takes is for a young girl to see one woman who's a pilot to know it's possible. That is awesome. <laughs> Yeah, Meike was awesome. It's really crazy. She was actually given a TV assignment mm. to fly a plane, learn how to fly. <laughs> and then, she, so, you know, anyone out there want to give me that opportunity? I want that opportunity. <laughs> I want to fly. <laughs> or if it's, uh, what other things could we do? Uh, learn how to conduct a train? I don't know, I would Ooh. do anything. Right. Learn how to um, jump out of an airplane. Like, uh, you could be the tandem instructor of a skydiver. Or learn I how would to love be to do that. a zookeeper. Ooh, I actually am oh. going to the zoo. You knew that. <laughs> I did. <laughs> <laughs> I am going, well, I'm going to the Greensboro Science Center and I'm soon going to um, the North Carolina Zoo. Okay. I haven't been to any of these things. That's the awesome thing about this opportunity. I get to actually learn about things, but also see the things I have yet to see in Greensboro. And you're really finding your groove. And I, I must be so inspirational for you to, you know, you're doing the story, but to actually see so many of these mm -hmm. women in power. And they're beautiful women. And yes. I mean that from the inside out. Like May Kay was a truly beautiful woman from the moment I met her. Um, she was just so kind hearted, wanting to really show me these things because she's passionate about yeah. flying. Well, I love these mole on the go packages. They're so inspiring and I can't wait to see the next one. I can't wait to see it either. <laughs>